came on down were completely automatic, leading up to eight point. Checks of the guidance and navigation system going on now. Now, velocity 1,582 feet per second. Five, four, one, zero. All engines running, commit, liftoff. We have liftoff, 11.22 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. Pete Conrad reports the York program is in. Tower clear. We a pitch and a roll program and this baby is really going. Pete. Pete Conrad reporting the roll and pitch program to put Apollo to upper course. Altitude at one half mile. Roll complete. Roger, Pete. Forty seconds. Mark one Bravo. Altitude. Oh, you got your GDC. Okay, we just lost the platform, gang. I don't know what happened here. We had everything in the world drop out. Roger. Roger, we copy, Pete. You're looking good. Good staging and good thrust on the second stage. We've had our problems here. I don't know what happened. Uh, I'm not sure we can get hit by lightning. Downrange 122 miles, altitude miles, velocity 10,000 feet per second. Uh, we've got uh, an ISS light on and we've got a cycling CO2 partial pressure high, which I don't bother me particularly, and we have reset all the fuel cells, we have all the buses back on the line, and we'll just square up the platform when we get into orbit. Roger, Pete. That sounds good. Hey, that's one of the better sims, believe me. We've had a couple of cardiac arrests down here, too, Pete. There wasn't any time for that up here. Your thrust is looking good, Pete. Okay, I have a good GDC, and Al has got the fuel cells back on, and we'll be working on our AC buses. Right, Pete, your uh, fuel cells look good down here. I think we need to do a little more all-weather testing. Okay, man. Goes the tower gang, that's the way clean. It looks good. Good show feature in mode two. Launch escape tower has been jettisoned on schedule. And we confirm the engine skirt separation also. 